Nevada students are continuing to make small improvements in subjects like math and English. That's according to a new report out from the Department of Education. Clark County students, though, they are still behind the rest of the state, depending on the grade level. Our Fox News Sean Dowling has more on the latest report card and what's being done to make sure all our students get a passing grade. To dive into the story, we need to do a little math. And when it comes to that subject, less than a third of CCSD students in third through eighth grade are proficient in that subject at 30.1%, slightly worse than the rest of the state. And 39% were proficient in English language arts, also lower than the rest of Nevada. Longtime teacher and tutor in the Vegas Valley, Patricia Gordon has seen this problem before. It's been a struggle because Parents whose kids are getting A's and B's think their kids are okay and they can't add and subtract. Gordon knows the percentage points don't vary by much in new numbers released on Monday, but she says those differences can be striking when considering COVID's lasting effects. I uh, naively had thought that after the pandemic, everything would just go back to normal. The students would come in and they were already years behind. Gordon has tutored hundreds of CCSD students at Matthews and has an assessment that shows her exactly what grade level they're at and which standards are missing. So I would have a fifth grade student two, three years behind. My opinion, they should have got people caught up, not just dump them where they were. For CCSD's part, 200 schools improved their index scores, with 80 increasing their star rating. State Superintendent of Public Instruction, Joan Ebert, is optimistic about the findings. How can we take best practices and make sure they're implemented across every single school in the state of Nevada? That's what this um, report card is to do. But to your point, do we have a ways to go? Yes. I'm Sean Dowling, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. And more than half of CCSD schools improved performance during the 2023-2024 school year.